that scene more than any other scene <laughs> probably speaks to the complexity of who Cersei is as, as a person, when, as a character, where she, she can be telling the story and actually eliciting the sympathy from you while you're watching the story. You're like, wait a minute, you know, and you can forget what it was she did or participated in that led her to be in this room with this crippled boy in a coma telling the story in the first place. And it just, the fact that you're being pulled between your sympathy for her and your disgust at, at what she's done and you're bouncing between those two poles hopefully like several times over the course of a scene, to me like that's as much as anything what Cersei is, is really all about.